Real quick, I do have to apologize. My mic has been acting up a lot recently, and it really shows in this video, so I'm sorry about that. But hey, if you like the video, make sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Stay tuned. I've got a lot of videos cooking up for about a month or so. They're all lined up, so yeah, like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and on to the video. What's up, guys? This is Subleaf Gaming, and today I'm reviewing an alternate for NK2K. Now, I know NK2K, um, the new one, it's not really the greatest from what I've heard. I haven't got it yet, but I have the old NK2K20 and I have the NK2K18 to 15. Personally, 15 is my favorite. I used to have the NK2K12, but it was really old when I sold it. I really like that one too, but today we're checking out the text based alternate. Created by uh, CF Reddit, this one helps them out. This video is not sponsored in any way. Um, I'm not here to think of the channel being sponsored. So, as you can see, they have real players, random players, all time team, custom. You can go into real players, you can build 2020, 1947, build whatever, rebuild, build whatever kind of all time team you want. And of course, the names are changed because it's copyright. It doesn't have whatever, but it's close enough. So you have your these are the Knicks, these are the Hawks, these are the Magic, whatever, you get it. And there's different difficulties to it. It makes like trades more difficult, it makes free and signing more difficult. It's not really the big of a deal, but let's just pick a random team, the Rockets, I guess. Let's hop into it, see what it's all about. So you'll see when I pull it up, I'm at the normal dashboard, right? It has the headlines, it has the record, the league leaders, team leaders, finances, team stats, the lineup, and the standings, right? So you can go around the league, see your standings, see the playoff predictions, see your finances, history, power rankings, transactions, and news feed, right? All important for rebuilding a good team in the real NBA. So this is almost like a really good simulation. You can go to your roster, you see if you have player ratings, right? Harden, Westbrook, PJ Tucker, Rocco, shout out Kenny. But um, yeah, you can see like move them around and see like they don't have a center, right? Well, I guess PJ Tucker for a center, but here it doesn't say they have a center. So you would move Tyson Chandler up here because it's a center. Mike D'Antoni, not knowing how to do stuff, but whatever. Schedule, your finances, your history, and your all time history for any leagues that you have. And then of course, you have your free agents. You can sign them if you have enough cap space, of course. Make manual trades, trade finder, scout in the draft. You've got your watch list of people. You've got, you've got your own Hall of Fame. Then you have your statistics and stuff, your tools. If you want, if you're not good at the game, you can name God mode. I actually, I actually do this a little bit because you can enable some different features. Like I really like player development, real player determinism. But we're gonna leave that off for now. And you can do different types of challenges and stuff, which I actually find really cool. And you mess with the salary cap, the team structure. Stuff. They even added the Elam ending. I didn't know what this is until it was added in. Basically, it gets rid of like the whole foul trouble thing at the end of the game. It's actually really cool. You respect it, which I actually really like. But, um, yeah. Let's just hop into a uh, simulation as it works. I want to show you guys how the trade form works. So, we're going to try and trade away Eric Gordon. Sorry, Rockets fans. And Daniel House. For 
let's say, decent center. Go into Trade Finder. And I don't see any, but we can try and build our own trade. We can try it again. So let's see. PJ Tucker. Daniel House. I think that was what it was. Oh, you've got my before to start the trades. So really cheap. Well, let's see. Um, Boston. They have Taco Fall. I want it. But salary cap doesn't even line up, so we would have to pay. Vincent Poirier and Brad want to make no and this board for me. See now he says he doesn't want. But you know what? We got picks. It's probably the smart. You can also say what would make this deal work. I think I would pull it off. Okay. And you can also cut people too, like Chris Clemens. I'm sorry if you're short like me, but I'm gonna cut you because you kinda suck. And Michael Frazier, I don't know who you are, but you kinda suck, so I'm sorry. And just for fun, we're gonna start talking about Because why not? <laughs> but then as you see with the lineup, you would have to also start Tyson Chandler because he's a forward center. Have to have Austin Rivers off the bench so the lineup so the matchups would work. And another great thing, another great thing about this game, in my honest opinion, we have an all-star game, but it simulates really fast. Even on my terrible, terrible PC, it simulates really fast. Fast in the Duke out. This actually doesn't look very fast where it is, but my PC is a potato, okay? Can you blame me? Okay, so we made the playoffs. Three seed. And just for the sake of the video, I want to see if we win a championship. Now it doesn't look like... Oh, we came back 3-1. <laughs> shout out... Oh, wait, never mind. I was going to say shout out... Um, shout out the Clippers for losing 3-1. Yeah, and then you have your um, season over screen. See who made the all league teams, all the rookie teams, all the defensive teams. You can even see who retired, who got all the awards, and let me fix this real quick. God knows you have your own little thing too. You can edit what the players are and stuff. It's pretty cool. I like it. We're just going to put Vince Carter in the game. Carter, Hall of Fame. Perfect. And yeah, I think well, we also do have a good draft. I should probably show that off. Yeah, like, do we not have a pick? Stand. I don't know if we 
is going to send me a draft and I'll have them all fixed. Re signing and free agency period, I'm going to end it with that. I think. Yeah, this is the free agency period. It's not much. Oh, I don't have it updated in the latest one. I'll do a separate video on that. But yeah, of course we're going to be signed Taco Ball. Five year. That's about it. Um, this game's really fun. You should go check it out, especially if you don't have a U2K, because I prefer it to be U2K is pretty bad. But yeah, there's a progression thing. Should have mentioned that. But um, like and subscribe if you really like this content, because it's it's pretty good. It's pretty good content, I think. Uh, and like and subscribe. Leave a comment down below. Turn your notification bell on. And feel free to watch like all of my content. You can dislike if you want, I don't really care. But like, um, yeah, I'm gonna see y'all next time.